morning everybody. Hope you're all doing well. It's now Tuesday morning. Well, it's late morning actually, it's nearly midday. Uh, I've not actually had the camera with me for the last few days. Uh, I left it in the garage at one point <laughs> and it was out of battery. So I've missed a few things, however, I'll catch you up with what's, called, with what's been going on. Thursday, obviously, we've got the bikes out of crates. I've got some video footage of that. And then what we did on the Thursday uh, afternoon was we all took the bikes over to the show. So there's like a centre square here. And they put a show on with the bikes and all the cars. It's a bit of a different weekend this weekend because because it's the 70th anniversary of the Macau Grand Prix, they, they're actually ran races, or they're running races on two weekends, not just the, the one. So normally we, we, we're a day early basically this year. Normally we'd do all the stuff we did on Thursday last week, we'd normally do that on the Friday. But because they were racing Saturday and Sunday, it meant that we had to get everything out and ready on the Thursday and we had the show and the opening ceremony of the Macau Grand Prix on the Friday. Normally that is on the Saturday. So uh, yeah, we did all that on Friday then. So we had to go to the square, get all set up and ready. Leathers on in the blistering heat. It's actually not too warm today. It's actually quite nice. But on Friday it was, well, I would say it was over 30 degrees, high humidity. And we all had to put leathers on, do loads of photographs. It's not very nice, but anyway, pictures look good. <laughs> uh, so we did the opening ceremony on Saturday and then we came back. And I'm trying to think what else we've been doing. I've been doing all sorts, really. I've been over to the Macau Museum already. Did a an event there with MGM. We're sponsored this year by MGM, which is fantastic to have such a big company supporting racing. They're actually helping a few teams, cars and bikes, uh, which is great to see. So we were at the uh, museum for underprivileged families here in Macau to try and give the kids and the parents something entertaining, something fun for them to do to be involved in to meet myself, Josh, Michael Rutter, and Faye as well. So yeah, we went there with MGM, so that was actually really good. It's quite entertaining. And the museum is absolutely fantastic here. Uh, I've actually got to do another, I'm gonna go back to the museum today for some some event with the, with the organizers. But we did that. Now I'm trying to think what else I did. It's, everything's been like a bit of a blur, really, to be quite honest. It kind of happens in Macau. <laughs> Everything becomes a bit of a blur. We've done a bit of partying. I'm actually not drinking. I'm not drunk for a while now, but uh, I can still party. So we've had some, some entertaining nights out. I always like my sleep, that's my problem. I could do one late night and then after that, I just want sleep, to be honest. But anyway, we've had a few few good nights out. Lots of fun. We did a HSBC Life event at their flagship store here in Macau, which was good. Again, nice to have support from such a big company such as HSBC. So we went over to their HQ, did a meet and greet with a lot of their uh, customers and obviously their staff as well they had a car simulator there actually with a circuit on it so Josh managed to actually do some laps of the track so we could learn a little bit which is quite good simulators are always good for that it's one thing watching watching a video watching an onboard you can learn a certain amount from an onboard but when you're actually doing the circuit on a on a simulator you're actually programming your brain a little bit so hopefully that's given him a, a bit more of an insight the game was actually really accurate which is quite good so 
he spent, I don't know, 10 or 20 minutes driving around and around, so that was good. Hopefully it gives him some understanding. Then we've done another MGM event uh, yesterday, so Monday. We, uh, we've basically done a bit of filming, so it was actually really interesting for me. As this is my, uh, how many times have I been coming here? I've done five races, so this is my seventh time here. Uh, my first year I didn't get to race, unfortunately. <coughs> I had a bike problem in, uh, in second practice. And unfortunately crashed, actually. I'll find you that bit of video footage. But, um, yeah, I had a bike problem, um, crashed, and, and then we bent the frame where the bike hit the wall it bent the frame i was fortunately okay but the bike was written off so i didn't, I didn't actually get to race in my first year just did one and a half practices and then i came back in 2015 so i've been coming back since 15 but i've not been here since 19 obviously well we got to see a load of things that i've not seen before um, yesterday which is really really nice including the temple uh, some of the shopping centres that I've not been to before either. I'm going to try and figure out how to get in the paddock because they're a bit weird here. I'm going to go a different way. They don't apply logic to the gate. So we have to walk all the way up one end to come back the other end. So instead, I'm going to walk up the lane. So basically there's an entrance there, but you can only go in that entrance if you've come out of that entrance you get the logic um, which means I have to walk all the way to the other end of the paddock to turn around to come all the way back because our garage is right at this end <laughs> anyway less of that um, so yeah we did about four hours of filming yesterday uh, with MGM got to see a few places that I've not seen before in Macau which is really nice and now I'm walking back into the paddock oh we did some filming as well with, uh, with the organizer so uh, last night I was doing Leather's back on again, helmet, and uh, doing the official photography and filming. It should look pretty cool, bit of blue steel. <laughs> and I'm wandering back in, oh, I did scrutineering yesterday as well, so leathers, helmets, boots checked, gloves, all that sort of stuff. We've got some more filming to do today actually. Walking up, I can see the team look already. You said half an hour ish. This is an hour to you. It's an ish. So you got out of it. It's now 12.30. I said it was about midday. I wasn't lying. Went to bed what time was that? About 11, half 11? Uh, it's about midnight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 12 hours sleep. Like I said, I need my sleep. Anyway, here's the garage. Got Cliff Eats. My bike here. Yeah. For the benefit of the tape. Last night at the bar, did you say, I'm going to watch the garage with you in the morning? I don't recall them words. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the lady that makes it all happen. Boss. <laughs> Basically has a go at us after five minutes for being either late or, oh, and this is Lee. We're gonna use some of his footage. This is her much better half. <laughs> she missed that. Anyway, she doesn't miss anything. Uh, yeah, we'll be using some of Lee's footage as well in this video. You'd have seen some of it already, no doubt. So we're just waiting to be told where we're actually gonna do this photo shoot. But it looks like we've got everyone. So there's car drivers here as well. Lane. Looks like the car drivers have been asked to wear their suits. Fortunately, us bike riders haven't, which is unusual. It's normally the other way around. Normally, the bike riders end up being in leathers and car guys and girls not. But anyway, all the way around today, which is nice. Thank God. Thank God. <laughs> what was it like on Friday, Brian? Oh, it's beautiful. I lost about four stone. <laughs> I've gained it all back again. <laughs> Brian's been missing in action for the last couple of days, like you know, like normal. Yeah, yeah. Well, you disappeared. Yeah. Just been swimming, chilling, swimming, enjoying chilling. the sunshine. Ah, it's, I was saying earlier how 
this glorious sunshine isn't normal for Macau. I'm not no. lying, am I? No, I'm not. It's usually smoggy and... Yeah. You don't normally get to see daylight, but it is really nice. Here's Bonnie. Wherever she is, she's <laughs> hiding behind me. <laughs> <coughs> I've been waiting about uh, oh, no, 15, 20 minutes? 10 years. 10 years. <laughs> We're finally doing some movement. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> you look like you can walk now anyway. So. Oh, I'm a bit better today, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and you can talk, I can understand you again. I need to Malaysia. Good. Dave uh, may have drank more than one drink the other night. Maybe. maybe. <laughs> Only maybe. And Pete was surprising me, he didn't even drink it all. I didn't. Good boy. I, didn't have one. Yeah, I think you drank mine. I did. <laughs> <laughs> so this is where we're gonna sit. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'll be whoever you want me to be, Joey. Okay. Well, it looks like putting the bike rides at the back out of the way so you can't see us. <laughs> That's what normally happens. Oh, we've got to on. What's that, Nicky? <laughs> Confidential. Oh, I'll be alright. Macau will be over by the time we put this out. I need to see how incompetent I am. That's it, yeah. Well, we're in, Dancy. Yeah. All good? All good. And you? I think so. I think. Putting all those fly riders at the back, out of the way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where are we going? All right, I'm going to walk along here then. Are we going at the back? Or not? Someone needs to stand next to Crowy to make everyone not look so quite so small. Yeah, if you go one side of Crowy and I'll go the other side lot. How are we doing, Crowy? Oh, mate. <laughs> ah, you look a lot better than you than I as well. The fresh, don't it? <laughs> That's a six hour sleep does. <laughs> well, I'm still at the back. I can get in your shoulders. Do you imagine how tall that would be? Yeah. <laughs> really Do you reckon? Oh, I'll do that. It's a good height for up here, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was hoping you could beat it. <laughs> Always the bike riders getting told off. It's like a dip different atmosphere all day, you know. And that one of those shoes, there's us. That's the cool. Is everyone's favourite dump? Because I'm the only one. That's the yeah. unfortunate thing for the public, isn't it? I'm actually the only Dominic in circulation. I think you're probably, yeah, you probably are. Yeah. I am, that's why I'm the favourite and also equally hated at the same yeah. amount. <laughs> Favourite and hated. There we are. How are you doing, Peter? I'm marvellous, thank you very marvellous. much. Marvellous. Marvellous. Show yes. ponied round. <laughs> Show ponied round everywhere. <laughs> That's it. For a good week. <laughs> then practice, what, 45 minutes? Is that what we're getting yeah. tomorrow? Oh, yeah, apparently a quarter an hour left is normal. Well, tell your viewers, it used to be an hour. Tell your viewers, what's your game plan? Do you just sail the whole session uh, or are you going to come in or what you're doing? Less break, or? more throttle, equals faster. You can f off because that's my plan. You, you, <laughs> you've got that plan nailed. No, but seriously, yeah, mate, um, tell them what, what, yeah, you, I don't, what you're I, thinking. I actually don't normally do too much in the first run. I normally probably do between three and six laps. All right. And then have a little breather, like have a little think about it. Don't change anything on the bike at all, even if it feels horrendous. Because right. that first session is always the worst session. So yeah. for me, never. I even do this even at BSB and all the rest of it. I always kind of do, probably at BSB it might be a 10 lap run. Yes. But I at don't do... At a track yeah, once a year, it's yeah, a little bit yeah, different. Yeah, and, and first session is always the worst session. So yeah. the bike always feels horrible. And it's very rarely that you jump on the bike first session one and it feels amazing. So I'll tell you what's going to be different this year though, is the fact that they've already had the weekend before yeah, the cars well, out a little less dusty, yeah. a little bit more rubber on the Josh ground. Josh was just uh, talking about that. 
it probably makes it worse. <laughs> there's more oil about. Ah, there's no there's oil. More man. There's more car rubber everywhere. Oil. Yeah, but does the car rubber actually help? I don't I'm know. I'm making it sound like I'm not riding yeah. as well. I'm just going, what are you saying? <laughs> Have you ever been to Mid Antrim? <laughs> what are you saying, Brian? Yeah, yeah. you don't know about oil. <laughs> Footpath race. Does she drink oil? Will she? Will she? What if she got it? <laughs> <laughs> nah, but like, Some of you might get that reference. <laughs> <laughs> but no, tomorrow looking good day. And yeah. then one out in and then oh, that that sounds cool. savage that. That's one of the F3 cars warming so up savage. in the garage. And then two yeah, outings no. Friday and then Yeah we've got two outings Friday. Race Saturday. Race Saturday. Yeah, early early race as well. So normally our race is about two o'clock in the afternoon, and on Saturday it's at eight forty. I think. So we have a warm up at half Do seven, what? and then straight in race it. at eight forty. So uh, and then beer o'clock. And then beer o'clock. <laughs> Pool and beer. Yeah. Awesome. It's my stuff. Bag Daddy. What's happening? <laughs> Big boys. In there. Right, back to the garage. And we've got a briefing coming up. See you in a bit. Briefing time. Here's uh, some more of the paddock. <laughs> yeah, the car teams. Obviously, tire changing for all the cars is here as well. Thank you, Peter. <laughs> You're on YouTube, you're famous. <laughs> Maybe it's because there was a car coming. No, it wasn't. It was like, well, you, you couldn't hear it. It sounded like he had, he had very good throttle control. <laughs> it's like being in every Hong Kong taxi ever. Go on, bark, 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 for anyone who's not been in either a Hong Kong taxi or a Macau taxi, um, you won't know what we're on about. Anyone who has will know exactly what we're on about with throttle control in taxis. They like to be kind of on and off the gas all the time for the entire journey. No idea why. It seems to be a Hong Kong and Macau thing. You let me know, otherwise I'll, if not, then... Uh, uh, send it, send it. <laughs> What are we saying, boys? Sure is hot. It's definitely warmed up now, isn't it? Come on, Brian. <laughs> Dave's still trying to learn how to breed and ride. <laughs> Did Brian see it too later on? To sign again? Yeah, sign okay. again. <laughs> Say hi for YouTube. Good. Oh, good. Hi, yeah, I'm back. Alright, where have we got a sign? Sign my name. Yes. I can do that. Yeah. Uh, Jacob's your team manager. Team manager. Team manager. Uh, team manager. Do you want me to be the team manager? Yeah. Alright, I can be team manager. Then sign again. Anna, good. Yeah. Like it. What number are you? 88. 88. 88. 88. Bat bat. This is. 88. That'd be me. No, no, no. Sorry, just for him. Oh, for him. Yeah, yeah. 88. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. That'd be me. No, no. This one, this one. Thank you. Oh. Now yeah, we're confused, aren't we? Is that 88, yeah? Yes. Are you sure? Back, back. Of course. Of course. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm very sure. Perfect. Okay, thank you. And go. You stop pushing. No, position has 16. to be there. Okay. 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 No problem. Thank you. And go, Thank you. Where are we going? That way, this way. Hey, Nigel. 
multifunction room. See, you all thought we all knew what we were doing, but really we don't. <laughs> we just wing it the entire time. I mean, I can't sit at the front of the class, <laughs> but I'm a little nervous that these guys are behind me. Oh, Josh is already in, look. Josh is well ahead of the game. There's my view. Prison visit. <laughs> is that what it is? You're, you're a prison prison visit. <laughs> what questions do you forget to ask in the briefing? As always, yeah, I have to sleep for most of it. I'll figure it out later. Why did you want to know? Are we allowed generators on the grid? Yeah. yeah. No one knows. No, no one's got the answer. I'm power my phone, you know. <laughs> what have we got to do now? Yeah, 88. That's me. What do you want? Just a little signature. For Saturday and Sunday. There you go. Thank you. Enjoy. Hello. Wow. We have lots. Thank you. Enjoy. Hi. Hiya. Good to see you again. And you? Yeah. That's it. Got all my goodies. Let's go.